I'm trying to help y'all out. This right here just took a lot of energy. Let me sit down for a second because you know I'm a little older than the rest of y'all, so I gotta sit down for a second because I'm trying to help y'all understand this book. Now look, we know the name of the book. We know me, we know who wrote it. We know we still talking about cheating, but check this out. Don't scroll up, scroll down a little bit. Just so you can see where it says www.mustbemebook.com. Now I need y'all to go on up there, grab your copy. Click, go through all the tangents you gotta do, order your copy of the book, so as you, otherwise you cannot keep up if you don't have a copy of the book. With the book, we can all go along with this together. We can be like a whole team. We can be like a 53-man squad, and we add it on people. We can be good growing bigger and bigger and bigger. Before you know, we got our own TV show. But all the way we can do things like that is if you get a copy of the book. The book is going to help you as it's been helping me and others around me. So now, when you go back, come on come on down a little bit. We see I don't know if you've seen me now, but it says www.mustbemebook.com. It's in blue letters, whatever color letter it is. It ain't just one whole word. Go and click it. I'll wait. Okay, y'all ready? All right. Now I'm back. Now I know y'all should have did it. It'll take but a few seconds. I mean, you got to get stuff together, but we're going to finish off this a little bit. Now, you remember the last question I was posed to you? Why would you cheat? Remember, we was in chapter 9 when we were talking about that. <clears throat> Strap in. We're going to read a little bit more, but we're going to finish it off this week. Because what we're going to help you understand is there's reasons why you shouldn't cheat. Because a lot of y'all are out there in relationships and you feel like you don't have what you want in that woman. But the thing is, it was always a choice you made. See, why would you cheat? Because you didn't take the time out to find out what woman or what man you want. You didn't take the time out to say, is this your favorite color? What type of food do you like? Can you even read? A lot of people y'all know probably can't even spell correctly. But you didn't take the time out to find out them. Because you done met them, you done talked to them, y'all done did whatever y'all want to do. All of a sudden, somebody done moved in with the next person. You got a whole relationship. They house might be dirty, your house might be dirty, y'all might match up if both of y'all houses are dirty. I don't know about that, but I kind of keep my house clean so her house can't be dirty too. Somebody got to clean up around this place, and I ain't going to be all clean by myself because once she got kids, my kids are grown, most of them for the last one. If she got kids, they better clean up too. I ain't clean up by myself, I'm going to get some help. But let's get back to the story what we're talking about. All right, y'all ready? I got y'all seatbelts on. Well, Walker's locked in. Okay. Now, now, the most admirable ones after saying that they would never do it, then they then said that if they did, it would be to make their mate feel like they felt if their mate cheated on them in the first place. Revenge is the worst thing in the world to try to cheat on somebody. Don't do this because you're trying to get back. My thing is, if you're accommodating each other accordingly, if you have a conversation, because nine times out of ten, everything was only a conversation away. You could have stopped it from happening. You could have talked to them. Tell me why you feel. Or if, the, if it feels like the conversation is blowing up, Take a time out. Take a breather. Let him walk off. Let her walk off. Let y'all collect y'all thoughts. Then come back together as a collective and go ahead and work on it. Because right now, when it gets heated, wrong things happen. Things get said that nobody wants to be heard. And before, before you know it, now he cheating, she cheating. And y'all come back home and giving each other all kinds of stuff that y'all didn't want. And somebody in this trap up. Now he wonder why he itching so much. She wonder why she can't stand up. And she be twitching like this. That's what y'all are facing. I'm like, okay, you one of them. I don't know what that is, but I don't want nothing to make me do this. Because y'all need to keep that. Cause that ain't the Lord's work. If you get something to make you do this, you better just... You better go to the doctor right away because that, 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 that kind of was no good. But we're going to leave that alone. But let's focus on this. Let's take the time out after you've got your copy, start going through the book. We're going to work a set of forms. So we can all come together, we can sit down here and chop it up like, you know, like we're supposed to. And everybody get to understand it because I'm not only growing from it, you're going to grow from it. And the people around you are going to grow and learn from it. So until next time, hey, we're going to change the subject. But think about all this, okay? I was going to dance for y'all people. Whew. I'm still a little tired for the first time, so remember, order the book, get your copy. We'll be at you next week. Hold up. Hold up.